Light shelves are becoming more common on many buildings. They save energy by providing shade against solar gain on warm days and direct more natural light inside buildings. Oregon Best researcher Kevin Newt of the University of Oregon's Department of Architecture is taking the light shelf to a new level by adding a layer of water so that the shelf reflects not only sunlight, but also the moving ripple patterns made by the wind on the water's surface. By transferring this aspect of nature found outside to the inside of buildings, Professor Newt and graduate student Aaron Weiss are discovering it has a calming effect on building occupants and might improve concentration. But in terms of its reflecting light back into the room, uh, absolutely um, comparable with a, a conventional light show. The wind is there, you know, water falls out of the sky, the building's there, it doesn't have enough change. So it's really about taking stuff that these separate bits that pre-exist and trying to make them come together. So the light, the wind, and the water, any, any two of those components interact with each other, but uh, getting all three to interact creates this very familiar effect. You see it on, you know, when you're not looking for it, you'll see it under bridges. It's, it's a light shelf and a shade awning, but it has this component. Oh, people really like it. People think that it is beautiful. People think that it is um, interesting. I think the, because one of the questions I ask, how does it make you feel? And most people say it makes me feel calmer or calming. You could have a regular light shelf here or a shading device, but it's not going to bring anybody's attention out to the environment. But whereas this, you know, some people will say, well, why is that there? What's it doing? And then a conversation about, shading and natural daylighting starts you know so it's a way of, in, of engaging people who otherwise wouldn't be interested in climate change and those sort of problems you know, sort of 